Oh no, Ninjaki, what have you done? Monkey Village, a minor quality of life for cheap Monkeyopolis creation, we included a, I quote unquote, small base amount of cash production to the generation formula. Monkeyopolis income formula now includes a base of 2.5k minimum. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, you can't believe how broken this is. So here's a new and easy farming strategy on how to get over 100k before round 40 on medium mode. And yes, this is without any penalty and you can use this even in ranked mode. Oh my god, I can't believe they did this. Alright, after placing down your free dart monkey and Ben, you have to place down one more sub or a boomer to prevent penalty time. So until round 28, it's basically a normal farming strategy. You go for two greater production farms. Upgrade one of the production farms to 2 to 0. You have to also put down an extra sub or an extra boomerang monkey depending on your map to prevent even more penalty time. And you also have to upgrade your other farm to 202 to have extra sell back and at round 18 you have to sell your farm and get your first bank. After your first bank make sure to build one more farm and upgrade it to 100 and after that you have to get a little bit more defense. I choose an engineer because we are going for a balloon trap later on. Now upgrade your farm to greater production and build one more farm. Only upgrade both farms now to 002 and 202 for extra sell back. Because at round 28 we are going to sell all of our farms and we are going for our miniopolis. And guys, believe me, this is going to be so insane. At this point just follow what I do, build two discount villages so your monkey town is a lot cheaper and also build a new 00 farm because it's actually cheaper to sell your old one and get a new one. I know this sounds dumb but it's, it, it does make sense. Now you still have to defeat the lab loons in round 28 so you have to buy a 100 sniper and put it on strong. And now you can go for your first mark place and guys make sure to always buy all of the new farms in range of your monkeyopolis for extra cash generation. In round 31 sell all your damage towers and get the balloon trap and make sure to balloon trap mike for a little bit. It's not really hard, you just have to replace the trap a couple of times. And now we are only at round 31 and you only have to do 4 more things. You have to buy as many mark places in range of your monkeyopolis as you can. For the camo balloons you can go for a 300 sub or you can go for a ninja. You also want to get the rubber to gold alchemist because the rubber to gold alchemist and the balloon trap are really good in synergy. Both of them are incredibly good for making money and you also want to add one glue monkey on strong so he can glue down all the ceramic balloons. In the end you just want to get a favorite trade boat in range of almost all your towers so you gain a lot more sell back when you sell all your towers in round 39 or round 40. Overall I have to say the Miniopolis is back and I'm so happy about it but I'm pretty sure Ninja Kiwi is going to fix this pretty pretty soon because it's so overpowered to get like 100k on medium mode before round 40 in rank mode. Anyways that's it from me, if you have other really cool things about the update make sure to put them down in the comments so I can check them out. And if you want to support me for free make sure to use my creator code and like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and take care.